Hi, I'm Hallie Bourne with True Self Coaching. I'm a meditation and creativity coach, and I am here to help you live your life more artfully. And today, because I'm feeling kind of moody, I thought I would offer you some tools on how to channel a difficult mood. I think our society does not do a very good job at helping us to channel our emotions. A lot of us are taught to be stoic or to distract ourselves from an uncomfortable feeling or even to pretend we don't feel it at all. So I want to give you some tools today for how to do something creative to be with your feelings and help to channel them. Let go of all ideas of perfection and let's get to creating. So it's really easy to get caught up in the minutiae of creating itself. Um, I'm just doing this exercise here in my living room. So just find a place to hang out here. I'm going to be on the floor and I want to show you some simple supplies. So a sketchbook and I've got a pretty big one. This is 11 by 14 because it gives me some space to make some things happen. I've got a few magazines. These are just expired magazines I picked up from work. Look, I've got Bizarre, L, and In Style. And then I have some markers. These are just Crayola markers I picked up at the dollar store. Some permanent markers that are like Sharpies, but are not Sharpies. And some skinny Crayola markers. Yeah. And then a glue stick. That's pretty important. And then finally, a pair of scissors. That's all you need to get started. Okay, I did the deed. I dumped all of my moodiness on the paper, and I'm going to share that with you now. First of all, I just want to show you my creative mess. Some of us have trouble letting life be messy, and isn't life messy? <laughs> all right. So my goal here was just to use as many colors as possible and to fill in as much space as possible. And I kind of went back and forth between bubbles of thought and then just kind of stating emotions or feelings. So you can see I've got hopeless and sad, cynical, stoic, doubtful, regretting, hapless, scared. And look at this lady I picked out. Now, is that a moody face or what? Moody, angsty, yes. And then you can just see some of the things that I put out there that I feel um, I can tend to get pretty, um, I can get into states of existential crisis with some frequency. So this is one way that I handle that. And just look at some of these things. The nice thing about doing something like this is there's nothing off limits. You get to write anything you want to. And then afterwards, you have the satisfaction of having done something creative and given yourself a way to just feel and be human. Thanks so much for watching. This is one of many ways I'll offer you in time to come um, for just how to be with yourself, to not judge yourself, to feel whatever you feel. And this is at the core of artful living, is you get to be human. And that means feeling the whole spectrum of emotions that are available without judging any of, the, any of them as wrong or bad. 
So stay tuned in, please subscribe, and thank you so much for being on the planet and bringing your gifts and your full heart. Take care. Bye.